Hello and welcome to An Evening with Sarah and today I am playing, as you may have already gathered, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Now, um, I played um, An Evening with Sarah of this, like, I think last week? So, uh, not of this, um, Philosopher's Stone one. Alright, sorted. I now can, I can now jump, which would have been extremely useful. There we go. Literally that simple. Wow. Oh, oh, oh. Shit, I'm gonna have to cast Flipendo. Flipendo! That's incredibly useful. Oh shit. Ooh, ooh, what's the card? It's a Alahomora. Alahomora. Gotta get the beans. Walking back, or fancy like. A wizard card. This is a bronze wizard card. There are 50 of these scattered throughout Hogwarts. Each time you collect 10 new bronze cards, you are given a permanent stamina Ooh. increase. Pressing the escape key will allow you to access the folio magi and look at the wizard cards you've collected thus far. I think we should look at the wizard card, don't you? So, folio magi. So we've got Hepster Starkey, um, 1881-1973, which who studied the use of, of phases, well, phases of the moon in potion making. Nice. Right, what's this thing? Flipendo! Ooh, colourful beans. Flipendo! Flipendo! Oh no. Do you want to give me more beans? God damn it. Flipendo! Flipendo! Beans! No more Flipendos? No? Okay. Shit, I think that might be a- no. That might be a secret wall. No? Just casual or cold. I th I'm thinking of the word, but if I say it, it sounds stupid, so it's not going to. Like, if you say it wrong, it'll sound stupid. Right. The anyway. rain has stopped. At least we'll be dry when we get expelled. Come on! We'd better get up to the school! I mean, you're pretty damn close. At least the trees don't look like green blocks anymore. Look at all the stars! Ooh, look at all the stars. They're all blurry. Is there anything? Ooh, hidden chest! Alahomora! So I actually want to try and get like all... Uh, I hope Ron didn't get lost. Yeah, I want to get the uh, wizard cards. Because that sounds fun. Because I'm actually really want... Oh shit, there's one up there! Right, okay, um, I'm gonna need some spells and shit to get down there. Okay, how do I, what's this, a spring? Uh. Do we need a sense spell? It's a nice night now the rain has stopped. Yes, you keep saying that. What is this? Alhamara. Ooh. Uh. Shit. I'm actually having fun. This is good. Like, now that I've figured out how to jump, <laughs> you know, that would be simple. Alhamara. <laughs> not that most games jump is space, not control, for some reason. No, don't have the right spell yet. Might need incendio. But I can't get that yet. It's down here. I saw some leaves, so... Ooh! Alhamara! Ah, oh, shit. Can't go in there yet. Alhamara! Get my bins. Do I need some new spells and shit? 
go to school, go to learn spells, go do spells to get the beans. <coughs> Ow. I'm gonna get this chest up here, and then we can go to school. And we can hear <sighs> Stephen Fry talking about stuff. And things. Alhamora. There's a little spring down there. I think it might be a special kind of spell I might need to get to places and stuff. Ooh, you can go up there. How do I go up there? May need the springy spell. Let's go, Ron. Let's go to school. Wow. <laughs> Those graphics. Gryffindor dormitory is just over here to the right, remember? Yes, I do remember, because I was here last year. Right, right, is there anything I can be found? Nope, not there. Oh, 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 chest. Alahamora. I'm gonna have all the beans. Fred and George will be jealous. He'll give me all the wizard cards, because I have all the beans. Flipendo. 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 Right, 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 right. Give me the beans. Give me the beans. Oh. Right. What the fuck is that? Oh, right. It was like a very angry face. Right, we're gonna explore the rest of school later. No? Right. The common room. The dormitory is up here, Harry. You know, it's a casual staircase. Although I thought it was meant to be on the seventh floor. You know. But I think it's just rearranged to Hogwarts. Finally, there's the portrait of the fat lady. Give her the Bit password rude. and let's go to bed. I thought you'd have the password. Why would I have the password? Why yeah, would I Ron. have it? I've been with you since we got here. Then why would I You're have it? Right. Ron? I better know who would have it. You know there what, Prefects? Or Hermione? Right on time. I heard the most incredible story about you two getting expelled over a flying car. Hermione, oh, please, we're tired. Could you just tell us what the password Why is? Why is Ron so huge? Wattlebird. It's, it's good to see you Wattlebird. again, Harry. What, what about Ron? Bit rude. There you two are. Brilliant entrance. Got the year off with a bang. Mum's furious, by the way. You two should hear about the bean trading system we've set up. It's based on Bertie Bott's Every Flavor Beans. Really? Fred, myself, and several of our associates have set up trading opportunities throughout Hogwarts. Some of us will occasionally have an item to trade. If you have enough beans, we'll trade with you. Where are we supposed to get all these beans? They're hidden all over the place. It's not hard to find them. You should have enough to start trading in no time. It will be a pleasure doing business with you, I'm sure. Once inside the common room, Harry was greeted by the cheers of his fellow Gryffindors. Harry and Ron became Gryffindor heroes due to their little accident with the Whomping Willow. Harry slept well that night and looked forward to his first day at Hogwarts. Good morning, Harry! It's time for our Defence Against the Dark Arts lesson with Professor Lockhart. I just love his books. He's such a brilliant writer. Defence Against the Dark Arts on the third floor. Follow us! Okay. Right. Is there anything hidden around? Anything besides Fuck car off. fly. There's a statue and a squiggly, squiggly thing. The handle cup belongs to Slytherin by right. Oh, Gryffindor up. won't rob us of it this year. I moved this, but what? <laughs> okay. Hello. Good day. <laughs> oh. Okay, Ron, I'm coming, I'm coming.
Harry, Defense Against the Dark Arts is up here. Yeah, Try to yeah. hurry, Harry. We'll get to see Gilderoy Lockhart in person. Why does Hermione have an afro? Anyway, I already met him in person, remember? Oh, hi. Um, hello, Smith. Harry. Oh, hello, um, Nick. Even after all these years, I still find new secrets in Hogwarts. Here's a special area that you can unlock only if you collect all 40 silver wizard cards. Silver wizard cards? Shit. For every 10 silver wizard cards you collect, you'll get a key that will allow you to open one of the four locks on the door. See if you can find all 40 silver wizard cards hidden throughout Hogwarts and the grounds. I do like collectibles. Flipendo! Flipendo! Hopefully the lessons aren't like in the other game. Where you have to go through really dangerous rooms to learn a spell. Upstairs, go! What's in here? Hello, or just A B. Alhamora. Alhamora. All the Alhamoras. There we go. Right, I'm pretty sure it's a floor up, but I want to. Ooh. What's down here? Many, many rooms. Which I blocked off. For Bendo. Yeah. Don't get the same spells. Because I'm only a second year and I haven't learnt like learnt non-verbal spells yet. That's the sixth year. <clears throat> so let's go to what is it, Defense Against the Dark Arts? With one Gilderoy Lockhart. There are many paintings. A lot of them are repeated. <clears throat> Alright. Boo Slytherin. You remember where it is, don't you? Oh! I'd better get out of here. Filch might be lurking nearby. Well, well, well. Oh. I heard a crash and what do I find? Mr. Harry Potter and a broken, irreplaceable antique vase. Argus Filch, the caretaker, was loathed by every student at Hogwarts. Some thought his cat, Mrs. Norris, spied on students. Honestly, it, it just fell. Come, come to me. Let me rip you. What was that? Hey, what are you talking about? I heard a voice. Hearing voices won't get you off. I'll mark this down against you. Now move along while I clean this up. Why can't? I can't just use I must have been hearing things. Uh, that would fix the antique vase. But I need to get the cauldron. Back to break more valuable Look school Pendo. property. I said move along. Look Pendo. Yeah. Oops. Don't think you can outwit me, Mr. Potter. I'm on to you. I know it's there, but what's here? To stay dragon, apparently. Oh, oh, oh. Alhamora. Alhamora. I definitely want to collect all the collectibles. That'd be cool. Yeah, this is like just an evening with Sarah thing, so I'll be probably playing about maybe 40 minutes of this ish. Welcome to Defense Against the Dark Arts. So I might finish up my own. makes an introduction unnecessary, but I'll delight you with one anyway. I am Gilderoy Lockhart, Order of Merlin, third class. Honorary member of the Dark Force Defense League, and five time winner of Witch Weekly's Most Charming Smile Award. Ah, I see. You've all bought a complete set of my books. Well done. Today. We shall be learning the Rictus Sempra spell. Rictus Sempra is very useful when stunning certain pesky creatures such as Cornish pixies. Rictus Sempra. Who wants to be first? Harry Potter, will you step down here, please? 
Lucky. Clear your mind completely, Harry. Don't even think about me. And concentrate on the symbol in front of you. If See the wand? It's, oh, it's going to move hell. its way around this. the symbol. It's so bad. At the exact point when the wand passes over the arrows, hit the corresponding arrow shit, key. Shit. This exercise has three parts. You must hit all of the arrows correctly in order to progress to the next round. Ready to try? Round one, begin! easier definitely a lot easier well done harry you've advanced to the next round five yeah. points to gryffindor kind of hard round because my two, phone's in the begin. way of the keyboard Well done. You've advanced to the next round. Yay! Ten points to Gryffindor. Oh. Round three. Begin. I'm pretty sure this isn't how you cast spells. Fabulous work, Harry! Aren't you glad you've learned from the likes of me? You've now completed the exercise. 15 Yay. points to Gryffindor. You learned Rick to Sempra. You didn't do as well as I did the first time, but then Bullshit. who could? Now, how about a turn in the spell practice arena? Oh shit, no. Welcome Harry Potter God to my it. famous Rick to Sempra challenge. To complete the challenge, you must find the completion star, which will be found at the top of this tower. Try to get to it as quickly as you can. If the challenge timer reaches zero before you have the completion star, Shit. you lose the challenge. Along the way, you will find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. Try and find them all. Crap. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points I will award you. Ready to begin? Good luck! Three, two, one, go! Oh. Firecraft. A nasty little pests that like to shoot hot flame out of, uh, well, Thoracic. at you. You can stun them by casting Rick to Sempra on them. Then you can use Flipendo to push them around. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking screw something, blast worms. This indicates that a fire crab placed on or nearby the symbol will cause something to happen in the world, Harry. Try and really? use Flipendo to push the fire crab onto this screw, plate. Rick to Semper. Oh, I'm up. Flipendo. Rick to Semper. Flipendo. Rick to Semper. Flipendo. Oh, shit. Flipendo. Oh, fuck. I was not expecting that. Rick to Semper. Rick to Semper. Oh god. I just lost my shortcut. No. Uh, That's what? a giant orange snail. Avoid touching them or their slime trails. The acid that they secrete will burn you. Harry, trust me, I know. Rick to Semper will stun them. And then you can use Flipendo to push them around. This is safe. Right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Rick Semper. Flipendo. Flipendo. Rick Semper. Flipendo. Rick 
fancy star. Right. Get him. Yes. Wait to Sempra. Wait to Sempra. For Pendo. No oh, shit. For Pendo. For Pendo. For Pendo. For Pendo. Wait to Sempra. For Pendo. For Pe oh shit. For Pendo. Luckily, I know how to jump now. Go! Alhamora! Yes! Silver Wizard card! Okay. That's not what I wanted to. Wait to Sempra! Wait to Sempra! Wait to Sempra! Wait to Sempra! For Pendo! For Pendo! For Pendo! For Pendo. For Pendo. For Right. Okay. Let's go. Gnomes are a greedy Ah, oh, shit. They will try to steal your Bertie Bot's beans. Flipendo will push them onto their backs and cause them to drop anything they might have stolen. You can also pick up gnomes and throw them around. Throw them into a gnome hole to permanently get rid of them. That is a gnome hole. Oh no shit. This is where gnomes come from and where they go to deposit stolen goods. Yep. Throw gnomes into these holes to permanently that. get rid of them. You cannot climb into them. Okay. It's again. <laughs> Alamora. Alamora. Dependo. Beans. Give me the mint. The beans. Give me all the beans. Let me pass this down. Alright. Chuck it up. Alamora. Mommy never smiths chests. Uh, wait to Sempra. Wait to Sempra. Wait to Sempra. For Pendo. 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 There we go. Come on, gold star. Oh shit. Rick to Sempra! Rick to Sempra! Rick to Sempra! Rick to Sempra! For Pendo! For Pendo! For Pendo! For Pendo! I'll flip you on your endo. Come on. Rick to Sempra! Rick to Rick to Sempra! For Pendo. For Pendo. For Pendo. For Pendo. For Pendo. Okay. 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 Right. Let's go. Okay. okay. I've got this. I've got this. For Pendo. Break to Sandra. Oh, my. We must. Ooh. Gold star. Rick to Sempra. Okay. Heading down and back up again. Climb, Harry, climb. The beans. Come on, right. 
Oh no! <laughs> right. It's a pendo. A pendo! Okay, secret hole. Holes. Oh, oh my. Yes! I'll look at the wizard cards later. Right, it's Semper. Oh. Give me the beans. Let's go. Ah, uh, shit. Uh. Pendo. The Pendo. The Pendo. The Pendo. Keep flipping the end Did it. Any spells? Nope. Okay. The Pendo. Uh, oh, it's a lift. Saving game. Oh, which way do I? Ooh. Alhamora. Go, we can do this. We must. I need to go places. Um, right to center. Right to center. El Hamara. For Pendo. El Hamara. For Pendo. No, for Pendo. For Pendo. I've got this. I've got this. Ooh. Have them all. Spin, 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 I can drop down, but is it worth it? Is there actually anything of use down there? Don't know. Oh, her mom. Yeah, wizard cards would be nice. I accept payment in wizard cards. Well, to be honest, beans do accumulate to wizard cards in the end. Okay, right, right, I've got this, I've got this. I've got this. Jump, Harry, jump! Or fall. That's not flying, that's falling with style! Come on. Oh, shit. Okay, come on, Harry, come on, Harry. I've got this. Jump, Harry, jump! Jump, Harry, jump! Harry is what? Parkour king. Get the bins. Go, go, go! Oh, shit. Jump! That's not jumping! God damn it! Oh, hang on, I didn't get the. Oh, my God. God damn it! Why did I die? Although it's max, you don't die unless you faint. But I moved back in time. We must. Um, Rick to Semper. Rick to Semper. Oh, my God. Pendo. Pendo. Alhamara. Flip hand down. Flip your hand down. Right, okay. Got this. Got this. Go get thingy. Alhamara. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I need to complete the challenge. Uh, Alhamara. Alhamara. God damn it, Beans. Can't you go in a straight line? Okay, I've got this. I'm not gonna die this time. I hope. Come on. Go, Harry, go! Uh. It's kinda hard because you can't really see down properly. Uh. Uh. Come on, parkour! Go, go, uh. go! 
almost caught up. Be careful. Actually, jump. Oh, shit. I did it! I did it! Right to Semper! Flipendo! Yes! Yes. Okay. Okay. Flipendo! Right to Semper! Right to Semper! Right to Semper! What's down here? Lights or anything of interest? No. Right. Let's go get the star. <laughs> Don't really need chocolate frog. Got seven out of ten stars. Flipendo. I really need to sneeze right now. Alhamora. I'm gonna look at all those with cards later. Oh shit. It's a trap! Rick to Semper! Rick to Semper! Lapendo! 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 Flip your endo! Anything up there? No? Okay. Alhamara. Yes! Go with the wizard cards. The Pendo. Save Rio. Is it four? I can do this. I can do this, right. I've got this. Uh, break the sunburn. Flipendo. Flipendo. There's a star over there. Break the sunburn. Flipendo. Break the center. Flipendo. Did that even go down? No. I'll, come, I'll go back for it. Break the center. Flipendo. Break the center. Flipendo. Come on. Bit more difficult now. Jump! Uh. Jump! Uh. Jump! Uh. Oh. Jump! <laughs> Fucking hell! Jump! Uh. Oh god! I have missed a star, but. Well done, oh. Mr. Potter! You have completed my Ritual Sempra challenge! The remaining time now becomes your personal high score! Oh my god. Oh, I might have been able to get more cards. Maybe I can repeat it at some point. God damn it. Right. I did it. I did the challenge. I did a challenge, right. Let's look at the, uh, with the cards. Oh, wow. So we've read, uh, Hesper. So we've got Myron Wagtail. Uh, 1970 to present, lead singer in the popular weird uh, band Weird Sisters. Got Heathcote Bar Bar Barbary. 1974 to present, plays the rhythm guitar with popular b wizarding band The Weird Sisters. Basically, just all the Weird Sisters. So, I've got Merton Graves, plays cello, and Orzian Thruston, and plays the drums. Oh shit, there's gold ones! Right, we've got Glenda Chittock, 1964 to present, popular presenter of the WWN Wizard Wireless Network program, Witching Hour. Oh, nice. What do you How want? How about a trade, Harry? A trade? What do you have? I have a silver wizard card. 
never even shuffled before. Press on the yes button to accept the trade or the no button to decline. Um, okay. I can't give this stuff away. Come back when you have more beans. Oh, God damn it. I tried. Harry, the weekly housework ceremony is about to start. Follow me and I'll show you where it is. These people are meant to be like 12? Why does this sound like a baby? Good morning, everyone. For those of you Dumbledore. who have trouble remembering names, I am Albus Dumbledore, Headmaster of Hogwarts. Welcome to the very first weekly house point ceremony of the school year. The house with the most points wins a visit to the Bean Bonus Room. Ooh. The length of the visit depends on how many more points they have over the second placed house. Let's take a look at the scores. Oh, it appears that Gryffindor is in the lead. Harry, it looks like you get to visit the bonus bean room. Why, Harry, why not anyone else? And remember, you only have a limited time to collect beans. Everyone's obsession with beans in this game. Okay, so I just touched the weird stuff. Uh, I'm gonna have all the beans. Beans! Uh, beans! Uh, oh. uh, uh, oh, I don't have the bouncy thing yet. Uh, Shit. Uh, God damn it. Have a more. Come on. Get all the beans. Come on. Got this. Have a more. So many beans. I tried for that silver whistle card to see. Run, Harry, run! Harry, there you are. Glad I found. Hello, Wood. Time for Quidditch practice, Harry. None of the other teams have started training yet, so we'll have a good head start. But I haven't had lunch yet. You can eat later. Follow me to the Quidditch pitch. Whoa, Wood. Whoa. God damn it, Wood. God damn it. I'm following you, I'm following you. Wood. Look at who's running. Stupid. Stupid running. Alhamara. Give me the bins. Hey, Harry, want to trade? We okay. have the best values in Hogwarts. Okay. Hey, Harry, want to trade? Yep. What yep. do you We have, have the best values I in have Hogwarts. Quidditch armor, just like the Chudley Cannons wear. Quidditch armor. The customer it. is always right, even in cases like this. Hey, Harry. What about Fred? What do you have? I have a Nimbus 2001, the best model available to the general public. You can't afford that. <laughs> Suit no. yourself. Don't know when I'll have these again, though. You... No, you... Ugh. What's down here? Where am I going? It's interesting. Right, I'll head back to Wood anyway. Let's, let's do some Quidditch, guys. Let's do some Quidditch. I love Quidditch. Bitches love Quidditch. Listen up, Harry. We're going to make sure we win the Quidditch Cup this year, and the way we're going to do that is practice, practice, practice. First, a quick recap of what we learned last year. Of course, you already know that the red ball is called the Quaffle, and it's the job of the three chasers to get it past the enemy keeper and into one of the goalposts. But you don't need to concern yourself with that. There are also two bludgers flying around, which you don't want to get hit by. 
But don't worry, each team has two beaters who try to keep them away from you. Last, and most importantly, it's your job as our Seeker to catch the Golden Snitch before the enemy Seeker does. Since you've been off all summer, let's start out easy. I'm going to throw up a Snitch for you, and I want you to try to catch it. Sounds easy enough? That's fucking huge! Oh, rings again. Alright then. You can use your arrow keys to steer your broom left, right, up and down. I'm, I'm moving, but it's not... The good. Nimbus 2001 gives you much needed speed. I actually have to... Oh god, I have to... The Quidditch arrow armor on. will help soften blows during the match. I actually have Being to hit the by a bludger, keys. pushed by the other seeker, or running into things can slow you down and put you further in the snitch. Got snitch! Now the rest of the Gryffindor team is here, let's play a mock game of Quidditch. Avoid uh, the bludgers the and the other sin? seeker. That's I'm going to have a Gryffindor stand in sin? as an enemy seeker. You'll need to make sure she's out of the way before you can catch the snitch. Don't worry, they'll take it easy on you. Everyone's a twin in the team currently. <clears throat> Come on, I need to get the stitch. Quidditch is a rough game, Harry, but don't worry, padding helps. Remember, Harry, do not put your hand out till the enemy seeker is out of the way. Oof. When you're close to another player, Harry, you can use your action key to kick or shove them. What's the action key? That's it, Harry. Give them a good nudge so you can catch them. Go ahead. Fuck off. Bitch. That's it, Go Harry. Away. You've almost Shoot. got it. That's it, Harry. Stay right on the snitch. You've almost got it. Yes. Pros. <laughs> See. Excellent work, everyone. Seeker. You're back on form, Potter, Why does I which means we've got a great chance of winning the cup this year. Go down, oh, no, Harry. Don't Go look away. now, but here comes a Slytherin team. I don't believe it. I booked the pitch for today. Hey, they've got new brooms, and, and it looks like yes, they are. They're Nimbus 2001s. Yeah, I know. Apparently, Lucius Malfoy made a very generous donation. Like our new brooms, Weasley. What are you doing here, Malfoy? I'm the Slytherin Seeker now. Didn't you know? Perhaps someday Gryffindor will be able to afford new brooms. Well, at least no one on the Gryffindor team had to buy their way in. They got in on pure talent. No one asked your opinion, you filthy little mudblood. Whoa. You pay for that one now, Foy. Well, at least I could afford it, Weasley, unlike you. Leave it, Ron. He's not worth the trouble. Mudblood. The nasty name some wizards use for other wizards who were born to non-magical parents. And speaking of mud, October arrived damply at Hogwarts, spreading a soggy chill over the grounds and into the castle. A different kind of chill would soon set in as well. It's time for potions class with Professor Snape. We don't want to be late. You know what he's like. It's down in the dungeons. Follow me. Let's go do potions. Woo. I'm going, I'm going, Hermione. Just know it all. Oh, this leads to the dungeons. No shit, Harry. No shit. Ah. Actually, yeah, it's probably just potion in this one, isn't it? Any, anything? No. Now pay attention. Today, you will attempt to learn the art of mixing one of the most useful potions ever concocted. The, the Wigan, Wigan Weld Potion. Potter, you have just volunteered to show the rest of the class how this is done. Get up here immediately. A Wigan Weld Potion will restore some of your lost stamina. Even a single bottle is capable of healing the most grievous wounds. In this chest are the two ingredients of Wiganweld Potion. 
Flubberworm mucus and Wigan tree bark. Take them out. Oh, no. Now, walk up to the cauldron. Try not to touch the potion. I don't want it contaminated. Where are you going, boy? Aww. Get back over here and complete your lesson. God damn it. Observe Mr. Potter adding the ingredients to the cauldron and mixing them. Careful, Potter. You don't want to lose house points. Mr. Potter now has a Wigan Weld potion. To drink the potion, press space bar. Back to your seat, Potter. Those of you who are jump. adventurous, or more probably clumsy, will no doubt want to make Wigan World potions on your own. Therefore, there are cauldrons like this one throughout Hogwarts. They are the only cauldrons in which Wigan World potions can be made. And the ingredients, flubberworm mucus and Wigan tree bark, can also be found throughout Hogwarts. Now for today's lecture. The history of flubberworm mucus extraction. Before that lecture, I thought I knew everything I wanted to about flubberworm mucus, and I was right. Well, I thought he touched on some interesting aspects. Let's get going before Snape comes out. Spiders. Follow the spiders. It was coming from over there. Come on. Oh, we're stripping balls. Come, come to me. Let me rip you. Let me tear you apart. I am a snake. <laughs> I am basilisk. <gasps> There's blood on the wall. The Chamber of Secrets has been opened. Enemies of the air, beware! And Mrs. Norris is petrified. Oh, that's horrible! What's going on? It was Harry. <sighs> Enemies of the air, beware! You'll be next, mudbloods. Don't bother. She's been petrified, but how? I cannot say. And now, I would like everybody to please return to their dormitories. There's nothing else to see here. Come on, Harry. Professor Dumbledore's right. There's nothing more to see here. But there's water on the floor, because many men have flooded the bathroom. Spoiler alert. Everyone at Hogwarts was disturbed by the attack on Mrs. Norris and the mysterious words scrawled on a wall. Rumours and speculation spread. Hermione in particular was especially affected. Ron and Harry became sure that she was up to something, but whatever it was, she remained tight-lipped. We have to get to charms class, Harry, and I have an idea. An idea about what? We should ask Professor Flitwick about the Chamber of Secrets. He's bound to know something. Let's go. I don't ask him any mess, or she's got the answers. Spoiler alert. What are you looking at? Oh my god, you're so rude. Is it springy? Harry, we don't want to be late for charms. Come in, Hermione. Hermione. Ooh, they're selling stuff down there. I'm gonna need so many beans. Holy crap. <laughs> so many beans. I don't even like beans. Although I do like Betty Bots and Flower Beans. Although the grass one's a bit weird. Off. Oh, Flitwick! Welcome so to Charm's class. Today we shall be learning the Scourge charm. Yes, Miss Granger? I was just wondering if you could uh, 
tell us something about the Chamber of Secrets. Well, Hermione. A deal well. with charms, Miss Granger, not myths and legends. Please, Professor, we all want to hear. Oh, very well. There were four founders of Hogwarts, Godric Gryffindor, Salazar Slytherin, Helga Hufflepuff and Rowena Ravenclaw. Slytherin wanted to admit only the wizard-born students to Hogwarts. The other founders refused, and as a result, Slytherin left the school. Yes, Miss Granger? He built a secret chamber in the castle of which the other founders knew nothing. With a great monster to guard the chamber from within. The legend states that one day Slytherin's true heir will return to open the chamber and control the horror within. And then all who are not wizard-born will be purged from Hogwarts. All nonsense, of course. Now, back to magic reality. Mr. Potter, perhaps you'd like to step forward and demonstrate Scourge for the class. Glad to, Professor. Whoa, Harry, whoa. Gotta get my arrow keys right. Oh, what the hell. Try not to focus on all this Chamber of Secrets, Balderdash. Concentrate on the symbol in front of you. The wand is about to move its way around the symbol. At the exact point when the wand passes over the arrows, you'll need to hit the corresponding arrow key. Okay, this right. exercise has three levels. In each level, you must successfully hit all of the yeah, arrows in sequence. Ready to try? Yes. Round one. Go. Harry, you've advanced to the next level of the lesson. Okay, let's Five go. points to Gryffindor. Yay! Round two. Go! Well done, Harry. I did it. You've advanced to the next level of the lesson. Ten points, points to, to Gryffindor. Gryffindor. Round three. Go. Oh shit. Well done. You've completed all of the necessary exercises. Yay. Fifteen points to Gryffindor. Whoa, over well 200 done, points. Mr. Potter. You've successfully learned Scourge. Scourge. Now it's time for you to test your doing? newly learned knowledge in the Scourge Spell Challenge. Welcome, Harry Potter, to my Scourge Challenge. To complete the challenge, you must find the completion star, which can be found several floors below us. Try to get to it as quickly oh, as you can. The if the challenge timer reaches zero before you have the completion star, you lose the challenge. Along the way, you'll find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. I highly recommend you try to find all of them. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points I will award you. Ooh. Flip Beans. Give me the beans. Ectoplasm is an unpleasant greenish substance left behind by certain ghostly beings. In some places, it will block doorways and openings. You can cast Scourge to get rid of it. Okay. First time I've ever heard of this spell. Anything here? Here? No. Scourge! Anything? What is down here? Nope. Oh shit. Ghost. It's a ghost. The pendo. Where am the frog? Give me the froggy. Give me the froggy. Give me. Yay. Scourge. Scourge! The pendo. You can also cast Scourge to free items that have been trapped by ectoplasm. Okay. Scourge! 
sketch. I'm going to go to this room. Alhamora. Alhamora. A bronze wizard card. Right, okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Nicky knows it's Harry, but damn it. Flipendo! 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 And go across here. And jump! <gasps> Star! Flipendo! I think ectoplasm I'm... takes away some of your stamina, oh. Harry. The longer you're in contact with ectoplasm, the more stamina you will lose. God oh, damn it. Scourge! Scourge! That's Chris. Anyway, I am going to call it here. Um, thank you for watching An Evening with Sarah, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I hope you've enjoyed this as much as I have. I think I might play it um, again at some point. But I've just saved it and I don't know when the next save point is, so I think I will have to end here. So yeah, I will see you next time then. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs>